Hi, for my activist project, I am helping spread the word about families who can't afford playhouses for their children. And this also includes just toys in general. And just like, I guess the whole message is for children not being able to get things that they should have, like playhouses. I worked with a group earlier this semester and we built, we actually built a big playhouse and there were other groups that contributed in that. And we all put in the teamwork and each uh, family was given the playhouses. And I have a prototype here that's obviously not the real big playhouse, but it um, is the same exact, the, the same exact uh, shape and what it looks like pretty much. It is just pretty much like this shape with the window and I just used the box because I don't have the images of the um, big playhouse we made, but that's pretty much the exact shape and replica, just smaller size. But basically with the websites that I read about, like NPR, they had articles and one of them was about how one in three families in America can't afford the things like playhouses for children that you know every kid should have and basically that's just it's really sex I didn't grow up around um, people in areas like that but I do have friends that did and they uh, said it really affected them and what you can do to get involved is um, to just go to these websites, um, which I will share, but they're basically just the Rhode Island kids um, toy donation. And what you can do is just help sign up and send money. Um, all it's really quick and it's all for the kids, which they deserve to have. So yeah, thank you. Hi, my name is Kyle McDonald, and I, I am here with Liam Rowland, Hi. my uh, good friend who knows a lot about this um, this project. So first of all, um, do you know any families or people affected by not having like enough money to have playhouses and toys? Uh, yeah, yeah. When I was growing up, I didn't have like I didn't have a playhouse. I didn't have that many toys. And all my friends, I like, didn't didn't really have toys either. Mm, and were, did you ever see like ads or anything for like toys or anything that like you you or friends like wanted to have? Um. Yeah, I remember like seeing a lot of ads about like Legos and shit like oh, that. Oh yeah. So yeah. I I always wanted Legos and like to, I always wanted to make stuff with Legos, but my family didn't have that much money, so we couldn't get that type of stuff. Yeah. All right, and then how long have you been able to build little structures like uh, like uh, playhouses and shed types of uh, things? Um, I mean, I've been making those for a while now because my, fr uh, my family friend, he, he started a nonprofit making um, playhouses and like stuff like that. So he wanted me to help out with them, so... Of course, I said yes, because when I was a kid, I didn't have a lot of that type of stuff. Yeah. So I just wanted to give back to to all the kids that didn't have the resources that I had when I was a kid. So I thought it was good to help out my friend. Yeah. Well